welcome back to my vlog. I have had a few little weeks off just kind of to completely, completely and utterly relax. I have been to B&M this morning in Home Bargains, bought a few little things and I just want to get on with a few little tasks around the house and things. Basically I bought a little chest of drawers thing, very, very cheap one for B&M that I want to paint and put in the corner of my kitchen just to put the internet router, yeah, on top of just because it's currently just sitting on the floor. So I just wanted to neaten that area up. Um, yeah, just got a few little things to get on with, so I thought I'd start start a vlog. I'm trying to do that messy, no effort burn. It's not really working out. I've been given a leaf hoover. Somebody has donated this to me, and I have absolutely no idea how it works, but I imagine it hoovers up my garden, hoovers up the leaves. Definite thumbs up for this device. Massive bag of leaves that would have taken me much longer to kind of wake up and scoop up. Awesome. I bought these two little boxes, pound each from B&M, and I thought I would um, just kind of pop them in here and spread out my beauty products a little bit because they've kind of become a little bit messy. them a little bit more organized so i've got my creams in there because usually i have to dig them out of this bag under here and it's a little bit more difficult at least i can see them and grab them straight out and my perfumes if that shuts yeah my perfumes can just go there that's easy because usually they're rolling around the back and i can't find them hair bits in there stuff i don't really use um yeah literally that is my makeup bag there are my creams and then this is like lip things um just a different selection of lip products that I use, and then my hair brushes and hair stuff. Ta-da! B&M today basically, um, I should be getting paid for, for this, <laughs> for advertising these products, but these were literally like a few pound from, I think they were reduced, they weren't eight pound, they were a few pound from B&M and it's supposed to be lights for behind your TV, but I'm thinking I might be able to put them underneath my cabinets because I do have some, these little things, you charge them and then they come on, they're not very bright and they need charging like really often. Quite often, whereas this one I think you plug in via USB and we could plug it into here, so I don't really know what to expect when they can pack it and whether it'll work, but we can have a look. Lights. What do you think, Jim? Really comfy. I'm so sorry. What do you think <laughs> of the disco lights? <laughs> you don't like the disco lights? Um, yeah. Why is that one flickering? <laughs> it's time for some yoga. <laughs> How up for this am I, Jim? Not. I've been absolutely loving doing yoga at the moment. But at the moment, I've just been almost sleeping to my favourite show. We've been watching Castle and I always fell asleep. And that's my favourite show ever. Anyway, Jim's going to cook us some dinner now. It's only quarter to five, nice and early. Nice and early. And I'm going to do, I was supposed to be doing 
trying to force myself to do this like strength yoga once a week but obviously I'm clearly not in the mood to do that right now so I'm just gonna do a nice gentle one that's more like a before bed one if you find me asleep on the floor gym in a minute <laughs> <laughs> just feed me my dinner I'll probably wake up and smell of sausages I'm sure but yeah I'm gonna go and do that but I really just want to sleep but I'm not missing a stretch today wow what's going on here Jim being forced to organize <laughs> As soon as he got out of the shower, I was like, right, so you're going to dust those shelves for me? <laughs> yeah, I've had a bit of a rejig in the lounge, actually, that I've not really, not really shown yet. I have put the computer desk that used to be in the spare bedroom in here, just because, for what reasons, Jim, did I do that? I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, mainly for my yoga, so that I can do yoga on there, and this is the area that I do my yoga in, believe it or not. I do kind of push the chair out the way and roll my mat out here and do it here and it's just easier to load up the website that I get my yoga from on this computer here. We have a lot of DVDs and things on show or Blu-rays as Jim would say. Oh, Blu-rays on the top. Yeah, Blu-rays on the top. DVDs on the middle. I just say DVDs as like a term for all of them the but strong. Jim's like no. <laughs> um, they just, yeah, we kind of got more and more and they just kind of like built up a little bit. And then, yeah, just kind of needed a really, really good dust because it's very difficult to dust around them because there are so many. And then Jim's got a little comics and things on display in here. I just wanted them to look a little bit neat, so I felt they looked a bit cluttered. So I've moved those lights from under my cabinet to behind my laptop. I thought that might look quite pretty, and it does. I like it. Do you prefer that, Jim? Yeah. <laughs> Only because it's not annoying you in the kitchen. That's so cool. I really like that. That's pretty beautiful. It just plugs in. It's the back of my computer. Like, well done, Jim. I won. It's very nice. You have won. I started spray painting these for the cabinet for the kitchen and then I ran out of spray paint and now I'm thinking I might just paint them grey because I can't bother spending money on another spray paint right now. I think that's looking beautiful. Might not even have to do a second coat. It may be okay once it's dried. Oh, this is the most exciting thing ever. Our favorite takeaway has reopened. Mm. What do we have? Chips. Salt and pepper chips. Salt and pepper chips. Uh, special fried rice. <laughs> <laughs> and hot curry sauce. Mm. Yeah. Castle and Chinese. This is the best. Yes, baby. <sighs> Oh yeah. Woken up this morning, fancy being a little bit more productive. So apparently that means making my hair curly. It'll do once again for a day indoors. Um, yeah, I think my vlogs are just me um, trialing different hair curling methods now, I think. Oh, I should have just left it. <laughs> hair was quite nice this morning, actually. What have I done to it? Right, no, that'll do. It'll be fine. I'm sure it'll calm down in a minute. Let's see. Just needs a bit of jigging. Yeah, a few things have changed this week, lockdown wise, the past week or so anyway, since I last vlogged. We can now meet up with friends, but keep two, distant, two meter distance apart. I've been out for about three walks, I think, three different friends, just having a catch up, seeing somebody face to face but walking two metres apart. Um, but it's been really nice just to <laughs> see other human beings. So that's quite nice. I know a few things have changed in England as opposed to Wales. 
But one thing that has happened is I am due back in work on Monday. Next Monday, it's currently Thursday, so I've only got four days left of this weird, what's felt like unlimited time off that I've had. I'm very excited to get back to normality a little bit and just, yeah, get back to some sort of routine. But obviously, I'm slightly nervous as well. It's quite nice because the office is going to be closed, so I'm not really going to see people. It's just kind of phones, emails, all that kind of thing. So it's kind of easing me back into it, so it should be okay. I don't know what to do with myself now, to be honest. Jim suggests I just sit down and play a game. But as I said, I wanted to be more productive and do stuff, and then actually, I'm not sure whether I kind of ran out of things to do. Have you got anything we could do, Jim? Nothing. Nothing to do. You can think of nothing productive. Not my job. <sighs> <laughs> I want to do something. Let's go to Chester. Come on. I know. That's the one thing I'm missing so much. Just going to Chester. Because every day off we ever get, we go to Chester. But we cannot. Okay, you haven't even eaten yet, Jim. Okay. Ugh, so you need to eat. Fine. It's almost lunchtime for me, so I need to eat. I'm hungry. I've only had cereal this morning. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. What to do with the day? The weather's a bit blur. Just blur. I'm going to do an hour long yoga session later on, but that's later. What are you going to do when I go back to work, Jim? Just this. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't it exciting? You'll probably start running then, won't you? As soon as I go back to work and I'm, I've got no time to run, you'll be out running. Probably. And every single time I go for a run <laughs> during this lockdown, I've been like, you coming with me? No. Mm -hmm. you the most exciting thing that's happened these past few months got new pans shiny new pans it's exciting bought this recently too this is exciting to go with our new pans isn't it yep there's a fly there it isn't it at least it solves that being there and then we can put tea towels in there this massive drawer. Tea towels. Probably wouldn't fit all the tea towels actually. So many. It's a bit flimsy. But it is what it is. £12. Jim's staring into the fridge. Jim's currently just inside the fridge, just looking for food. Aren't you, Jim? Mm -hmm. Looking for ideas. Can't beat what we had last night, really, can we? Not Chinese. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun. Dun. The rain sounds beautiful. I bought these lilies the other day as well, and I'm actually keeping them alive so far, Jim. Oh, the rain sounds nice. Rainy, rainy, rain. Somebody's mowing their lawn. Do you do? Should probably not do that. I'm going to make my classic egg on toast because I'm terribly hungry and it's only quarter past 12. I'm very, very hungry. Um, my hair is no longer curly because I just ran to co-op. That's a big fan. I drove in the car to co-op to get a few bits um, because I'd run out of bread for my egg on toast mainly and Jim wanted some crumpets and it was checking it down outside so yeah pills are gone i'm afraid absolutely gone Time. Let's talk. So 
Oh, it's the man in the cup of tea at the same time as me trying to make a hot chocolate. It's too much to do, Jim. Lazy. Too much to do. Lazy. Ah. I almost forgot to make Jim a cup of tea. So now since I had a nice hot chocolate so now that's gone down nicely I'm gonna go and do some yoga and I've got an hour long session to do today I may sneak in a couple of clips of me doing it but depends <laughs> Since doing that yoga session, which exhausted me, I've had quite a relaxed time really. Me and Jim have had pizza for dinner and just relaxed watching some more episodes of Castle. And then it's a really, really rainy evening and I thought I might go for a run, but the yoga kind of hurt my back a bit. So I thought I'll go for a rainy walk. And then I've somehow roped my friend Darlena into coming with me. Um, so obviously, yeah, we're going to keep two, dis two metre distance apart, but we're going to go on a little rainy late evening walk together along the coast. Are you jealous, Jim? No. No, he's not jealous. <laughs> There's some um, PlayStation 5 kind of, oh, what do reveal. I call Reveal thing going on yeah. at nine o'clock. Put him? Event. Event, yeah. So Jim, like, obviously wants to be in for nine o'clock, and I meet my friend at quarter past eight, so... I don't know quite whether I'll make it back in time or whether I'll miss a bit. Jim thinks I'm going to be asleep by the time I get home anyway, so... By the time I get home, like, on the way. <laughs> no, Jim thinks I'm going to immediately want to go to bed when I get home. We'll see how I feel after this rainy walk. Almost forgotten this already. <laughs> I thought it would be a nice, refreshing, kind of, like, warm air, nice, drizzly rain or heavy rain even, but it would be nice. It's also quite windy. Um, so how me and Arlena are going to hear each other speak when we're two metres apart and in rain and wind on the beach path, right on the coast, I don't know, but we'll see how we go. She's going to hate me for this idea. Whoops. 
like we actually absolutely loved it that was amazing i really don't know how wet i am underneath here oh yeah my hair's stuck to my face that was so much fun it was really liberating i feel like i feel like i've been shouting i feel like i'm still shouting because it was just yeah windy rainy and obviously we're a little bit apart there she goes she's off <laughs> so oh that was so liberating it was so good <laughs> so i'm not asleep like jim thought i'd be asleep um and i'm gonna go home and get into my comfies hopefully my hair won't be too uh, take too long to dry and we'll watch this playstation 5 thing